This is the carbon tree animation. It's an interactive tool for teaching and it will show you how Scott Spine is fixing and releasing carbon. The tree here reflects the real Scott Spine, which is located at Smear 2 measurement station in southern Finland. These small, constantly moving particles represent carbon dioxide molecules that are captured and released by the Scott Spine. Below the carbon tree, you will find the value of the net carbon flow rate in real time. In practice, the value tells you whether the Scott Spine is mostly fixing or releasing carbon. When the flow is negative, the tree is releasing more carbon than fixing it. You can get more information about carbon flow by clicking this information icon. Now you can view all the components that together form the net carbon flow rate. You can click the icon and see the related information on the right side. You can also study the carbon flow properties by clicking the value of carbon flow. Now you are in a custom flow mode and you are able to adjust the components one by one to see how they affect the net flow. The value of carbon flow updates immediately when you change one of its components. When you want to move back to the real-time mode, just click the back button and the animation gets back to its default state.